Welcome to Arson Pause website and to my social media pages. We continue uh, of our exercise of utilizing the three uh, simple principles to start sensing, to start discovering the tremendous amount of love around us. Uh, last video we took the pen as an example and we start observing the pen. In this video, uh, I'm going to take another object. Take, for example, a pencil. So, let's go. We start with uh, the first thing is uh, uh, knowing that everything in this un beautiful universe was created with love. Let's think of it mentally for now. Even if we don't believe in anything like uh, spiritually or any kind of that, you just tell yourself mentally that this object and everything else in this life must be created with some sort of emotion some sort of purpose and uh, the other uh, uh, the other uh, uh, principle is that since this object appeared in my life then uh, I can deal with it with positivity, like with, with, with good side of the thinking. It's not the negative side, because you always have the choice of uh, thinking. Either you think positively or negatively, always. And everything in this life is mutual. You give it the uh, side that you, um, uh, you tend to focus on. Either the positive side or the negative side. It's always your choice always in any object in any situation so you give it that benefit of thinking in in a positive way that it's there in your life for a purpose and that is for good purpose and the third principle is that um, uh, and the third purpose is that um, I, the third, uh, and the third principle is that, you know, it's there. Uh, I want to check the detail of it because I want to live in the now. I want to utilize this object, thinking into the detail of it because I want to utilize it in shifting my mind in thinking in the now, in this current moment, because there's nothing but the current moment. So let's say, for example, the pen. Uh, the pen, it's made of wood. <coughs> sorry. The pen is made... Uh, sorry, uh, not the pen. The pen was the previous video. So we'll take the pencil. For example, the pencil is made of wood. Primarily, it's made of wood. And it makes of that black material inside that, you know, when you pass it through the, on the paper, it leaves a mark. So that's the writing. So that beautifully crafted pen is made of wood. But where does this wood come from? It comes from the tree. Then how this uh, beautiful shape of the section of the pencil was made? It was you, uh, the, the, uh, there is certain amount of machine, there's certain uh, type of machine used to make it that beautiful section. And how it, uh, how it was painted then how this uh, little eraser little uh, like eraser it was fixed to the back to the end of the of the of the pencil so you start thinking of these details by thinking about the smallest details of the pencil you have achieved a great um, uh, mental progress by shifting your focus, by redirecting your uh, uh, chain of thoughts towards the now, towards here and now. So I believe from my experience, when you do this exercise, you start feeling kind of gratitude 
for this, that existence of pen in your life. You feel thankful. And then you start slowly feeling the emotion of love toward that small creature that show up in your life. And when you feel thankful and love for the creature, then <laughs> spontaneously you will feel grateful and gratitude and love for the creator so this is the second uh, example of how you can shift your thought towards the now uh, my book 71 forms of love is available on amazon platform you can check it on check the uh, through the link uh, on the on the bio and uh, I really appreciate if you can uh, like, share and subscribe for whatever platform you are following me through. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.